I think the customers will set the pace and they will set the adoption rate. And if we are able to make it easy and the experience faster and better, that adoption will be impacted. Um, but none of it can happen without trust. Mm. And so if this, while you can um, take a process and make it digital, you have to constantly go back and determine, are you building trust throughout this process? Is the customer dropping out at certain places? If so, why are they dropping out? And yeah. I think that um, that will determine the success and the pace that people move through this. And the more, like I said, the more complicated the product is, or frankly, you know, if you take homeowners, for example, um, it's a great one where that's in many cases, a, a customer's biggest asset in their life, maybe outside of their 401k or their retirement. And so they may not want to go through that in a completely digital fashion. Um, and that's okay. I think that we have to continue to augment a journey with digital experiences and personalization and, and let the customer determine the path and the pace by which they want to do that. Mm. And, um, I just believe that that's what will determine in my, the way I look at my role and in, in the role of my team is to be there, to learn those things, you know, upfront and then figure out where to invest further yeah. and, and then to be ahead of the curve. And for carriers who haven't invested in that modernization, who haven't figured out that you can, you can't force partners or customers through one consistent path. Um, the ones who can figure out how to do that in a, a modular fashion are going to win. Yeah. And so to me, it's not if it's when, and it's going to come down to execution. And that's why I feel so uh, passionately about learning through the process with the partner, with the customer, using data to drive your decisions and then change and evolve based on that data. I'm Angie Collette from Nationwide Insurance and this is the future of insurance.